tangent to a circle welcome to this video in our previous video we learned about tangents and some interesting facts related to it today in this video we will get to know more about tangents to a circle in our previous video we left this question unsolved for you to try so before moving ahead let us discuss this question you must remember that there is only one tangent at a point of the circle and circle is a collection of infinite points hence there can be infinite tangents to a circle in our previous video we learned that the tangent to a circle is a special case of the sesant where the two end points of a corresponding chord coincide let us look at this activity to understand this better first let's draw a circle and a sesant mn of a circle now if various lines are drawn parallel to this sesant on both the sides you will find that after some steps as we are reaching towards the circumference of the circle the length of the chord formed by the lines will gradually decrease which means that the intersecting points of line and circle are coming closer in case 1 and 2 of sesant the distance between the points becomes zero which means that both the points coincide on observing you will find that in this situation Line one and two are two tangents parallel to the sesant MN. With the help of this activity, we can say that the tangent is a special case of sesant where both the ends of the corresponding chord coincide. Let us see another activity. Draw a circle and its tangent on a piece of paper. Now, if from the center O of the circle some lines to the tangent are drawn which are oa ob oc od oe of og and oh on measuring these we find that the line od is the radius of the circle its length is the shortest of all also if we measure the angle between the tangent mn and the line od you will find that it is right angled that is line od is perpendicular to tangent mn based on this activity we can say that the tangent at any point of a circle is perpendicular to the radius through the point of contact you can confirm this yourself by any other method today in this video we saw the relationship between the radius of a circle and its tangent In the next video we will see some more examples of tangent